score announcements for the day. Here are the scores for the boys and girls flag football games. As for the girls game, it was close. They put up a fight and barely lost, 6-13. to As for the boys, they had a great game and won 52-6. Congratulations to the boys flag football team. And get ready because next Tuesday, October 19th, we have a home game against Vertita. And now, here is Devlin for information about report cards. With the end of the first quarter, we'll be distributing report cards today. Students with straight A's, all A and B's, and straight O's in citizenship will be recognized during lunches. Unfortunately, at this time, we are not able to do our parent lunches, but hopefully, we will be able to resume those at the start of third quarter. And now, here's Jordan and Joseph with Oktoberfest. The school carnival will be happening soon. On Friday, October 22nd from 4.30 to 7.30, there will be carnival games, a haunted house, and food booths available. A change for this year is only current FEST students and immediate families may attend. Students will need to have their ID to enter. Also, students will need to purchase a minimum of $10 worth of tickets in order to attend the event. And on to Kiki with Library Snacks. Snacks. was supposed to sell snacks on Monday and yesterday, but, but they will be selling them today. Make sure to bring your money to buy some delicious snacks and help, our, to help support our book club. Now here's Kaylin with Ramen and Canes. I can't believe we have Ramen on Monday, Panda on Wednesday, and Canes every Friday. Every Monday, a two flavor of ramens will be selling for $1 at lunch. The flavors you can buy are chicken and beef ramen. So make sure to bring $1 next Monday so you can have some spooky, delicious ramen for lunch. And I'm not done. Cane's is tomorrow with a two finger meal with fries and Cane's special sauce with Texas toast. Be sure to bring $6 for Cane's tomorrow. I'm Celeste and this is your weekly movie review. After months of delays, the 25th official James Bond film is finally here in No Time to Die, an epic action film that presents 007 with one of his toughest missions, and the era that most people agree gave new life to one of the most iconic film characters of all time. Everyone knows that this is Daniel Craig's last film as Bond, and so No Time to Die needs to entertain on its own terms and provide a sense of finality for this chapter of the character, and even hint at the future of the spy with a license to kill. There have been rumors as to who would fill the role of 007 in future movies. These rumors have been put to rest. The newest 007 is none other than Lashana Lynch, a British African American actress. Lynch was a single mother pilot in the 2019 movie Captain Marvel. We look forward to seeing what she does next with the 007 character. Stay tuned for more movie reviews next week on Festflix Movie Review. Well, that's it today. I'm Maddie, and we're broadcasting to you from Festflix Daily. Make it a great day or not. The choice is yours. Bye, Flyers. Bye.